It's not often that you see a rehearsal and you can almost get tears in your eyes. I think that um, I think that what David has done will always be with us. I don't think this is just going to be a fly-by-night where we're going to see it this year or next year, whatever, and that's going to be it. I think as all of the great operas, I think this will always be with us. And I'm very thrilled about that and I'm very thrilled for David and for the house. imagine it not appealing to everyone <laughs> even if you don't like opera the melodies that he has put in like in the last act um, you can't help but feel the music that he is that he has done and uh, I, I think that it's going to be a very popular opera uh, for many many people the melody is wonderful it's haunting it's romantic it's everything we talk about when it comes to an opera and the person that did the libretto, Bernard, followed suit with the lyrics. And so I just experienced a wonderful thing. I can hardly wait. It's an incredible story, and the music goes in the meaning of the story and feel like they have lived three hours of extraordinary emotion and basic emotion, not intellectual one, okay? Basic emotion like love and pain and just pure raw emotion for three hours. I think that's the most important. One of the things that I think is really interesting about this piece in particular is that it has, from what I heard yesterday, it has tremendous show quality. From the first bars, it was the experience I had of hearing the music and then imagining the production that I know Bernard will give it within the, the production that I'm designing, I felt from the first moment that the audience is gonna love this. As the curtain goes up, I know the audience is just gonna be, wow, because it sounds so beautiful. 